Wouldn't it be great if there was an easy way to take an existing motorcycle and convert it from gasoline to electric? Well, that's exactly the solution that I've created with Shandoka Electric Motorcycles. Behind me you see the globally patent pending adapter system that allows me to use a stress bearing system to adapt an existing motorcycle into something that can carry compartments for battery systems, power drive systems, and all of the electronics required to run and operate an electric motorcycle while still maintaining the original VIN numbers and DOT approval ratings of an existing motorcycle. The system makes it easy for trained shop mechanics at existing motorcycle shops to be able to go out into the community, find motorcycles that are suitable for conversion, usually in a non-running condition for a very low price, do the work during a slow season to adapt these motorcycles into full electric drive, and have them ready to sell. In this method, we simplify our manufacturing process. We distribute our factories, as it were, into the hands of the local motorcycle mechanics who understand their community and the types of motorcycles that people want to have. And we maintain the strength of that dealer network for being able to take care of and maintain and manage the electronic systems of these motorcycles going forward. So we're able to create a B2B to C solution that maintains existing dealerships who are facing problems in their business model as gasoline motorcycles begin to go away. You see, an electric motorcycle doesn't need nearly as much maintenance on the full lifetime cycle as a gas-powered motorcycle does. And many motorcycle shops make all, if not eight, only 80% of their income from that shop work. So, by creating a method where those motorcycle shops can put their efforts and their labor into the value of the motorcycle that they sell, we help to maintain the culture that makes sure motorcycles are real and fun and awesome, even as they change and morph into quieter, more environmentally responsible machines. It's important to make sure we're still able to have fun on motorcycles. It's important to make sure that when you want to make noise, you can make noise. And it's important to make sure that as these beautiful old motorcycles become less likely to operate, that we can move them over to electric power and keep some of that beautiful industrial work and industrial design that we've had at our fingertips as motorcyclists. Have a great day. This is Ernest Ike, founder of Shandoka and inventor of the modular electric motorcycle. Check us out on all your favorite social medias and please tell your friends.